Hi Kate, I'm so glad you're 80. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, birthday dear grandma. Happy, Happy birthday to you. Cha cha cha. And many more. <laughs> Did it. Hi Kate, happy birthday from Rich and Rochelle, longtime friends of Lorette and the rest of your family, your big, loving, big, big family. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Oh, hi Kate. Happy birthday. Happy 80th birthday. This is a wonderful celebration. And I'm thinking now all of a sudden of how far back we go, way, way, way back. I remember when I met you at the Guild and the Guild meeting many years ago. and. Uh, I think Lorette might have been just barely crawling at that time. Uh, we've had a long, great journey together, and I sure look forward to many more years to come. You're a dear, dear friend, and always in my heart, and always will be. And actually, you're my sister. <laughs> happy yeah, birthday. Yeah, happy birthday. It's been a, been a long ride, but it's been a good ride. I hope I have as good a ride as you do to 80. <laughs> Thanks. And I, if you don't know, I'm the dear friend of the family, in case you forgot. And um, thank you very much for all these years of welcoming me into your life with your family. And um, I've been around the block in a lot of different decades through the different hairstyles. and different shoulder pad options through time. And uh, thank you, Kate. You guys are awesome, and, and I love being part of your family today and all the years past, so thank you very much. Keep on going, girl. Happy birthday. Hi, Kate. We've been friends for so long, over 35 years, I think. And I love you a lot. Happy 80th birthday. I'm so grateful for our friendship. Happy birthday, Kate. You still look like you're 70, <laughs> or maybe 60 even, by the way. <laughs> Hi, Kate. It's Jenny and Jason. We just want to wish you a happy 80th birthday, and we're glad we're here to enjoy this with you. Many happy memories. Yes. <laughs> Hi, Kate. We're so glad to be here with you to celebrate your birthday. We have spent the last 14 years living closer to you than any of your family. But we are delighted to be here and get to meet them all and to share this wonderful occasion with you. Kate, as long as uh, we've known each other, it's been a great experience and we're delightful to have you as our neighbors. Thank you. Hi, Mom. Um, happy 80th. Uh, I just want to tell you a little story about what happened on your 80th birthday. Your sister, Mary Lou, um, pulled me aside and told me a little story that I thought was kind of, uh, kind of sweet. For it was, it was she, her, she's 86 at this point, and she pulled me aside and said, "I need to tell you something, and I probably will never get a chance to tell you because I may never see you again," which I thought was kind of sad, but. Um, she was telling me about a time when I was about two and I went up there to, to yeah. live with her because you were in the hospital. And yeah. um, she had gone out to a party for Bob's um, mom and dad's 50th anniversary or something like that. And she came back and your mom had um, been taking care of us because she couldn't go because there's too many kids and whatnot. And, uh, she started crying about it, which was kind of weird. Um, and she was telling me how she got home, and at that point I was confused and didn't know who she was anymore, and I used to call her mom at that point, and Bob Dad. And she said they came in and I started crying for Mommy, which was her, and um, Grandma spanked me and she was feeling so bad about it, and she was like, are you still okay? <laughs> and anyhow, 80th birthdays, kind of an interesting thing so many years later. So. Happy birthday, and uh, hope you have many more. And I'm okay. It didn't. I, I think I'm fine. I I like it in spank now, so I don't know. It seems okay. Hey, Grandma. Happy birthday. Um, 
I hope all is well and I hope you had a good party and I hope you liked the video and all the nice things I wrote you and everybody else wrote you and uh, I'm happy you're here so love you. Hey Grandma, happy birthday! You're 80 years old. You just say you're 40. But anyway, um, you're just a really, you're just a real good grandma. We love you a lot, and you can I'm ask you more. <laughs> you can ask all of the grandchildren here. They all love you exactly the same. No one likes you. Anyway, so um, just having a great birthday, and you know if you. And if you really, um, if you're really having a great time, you know, just text have fun. Me. Have fun. Just really have fun. No, text me. Hey, Kate, do you remember when you were redecorating your house on Thornberry and you actually asked me to help you pick stuff out? That was like the first time anybody really treated me like an adult and talked to me like I mattered. And I will have never forgotten it. And I love you. And I feel like you were one of the people who made me feel good about myself when I was young. And I thank you. Happy birthday. So Kate, like I've told you before, I always have felt a really special connection to you and felt like I've learned a lot from you and I hope and that I can um, follow in your footsteps. You inspire me to be living the life that you are. As you turn 80, I really respect you and feel that connection and want that to continue and know that um, you're a part of who I have become. So thank you and happy birthday. Um, and Kate, um, when I got to visit you in Chicago and like hang out at your house and like talk to you like one on one just like all the time, it was the best. Um, uh, you're awesome. I, I adore just seriously just talking to you all the time. Um, this party's awesome. You're awesome. I love you. <sighs> Happy birthday. Grandma, I just want to say that you're the most unjudgmental person I've ever met in my life and you really listen to all sides of the story and I really respect that about you. It's, it's taught me a lot in my life. And um, happy 80th birthday and I'll be here for the 90th. <laughs> I hope it's at this house. Grandma Kate, I love you dearly. You've been so sweet to me, so sweet to everyone. In comparison to Grandma Carol, you definitely come out the sweeter, more sensitive type. Um, probably the only one that gets that here. You're pretty everyone, hip. Everyone's pretty laughing hip over there. Great speech. You're hip. Love you to death. Uh -oh. Love you to Can't death. wait for the 90th. Right here. 10 years. Hi Kate. It's David White here. Oh my god, you're 80 years old. I am so impressed. I am so impressed. I am so impressed. I'm impressed. You have built a generation of children that will go forth and multiply in hundreds of years time. Let me say again, in hundreds of years time. Hundreds of years time. But tonight has been amazing. I hope you've thoroughly enjoyed yourself. I hope you have your sexy outfit on for later because David White is coming to your town soon. Bye bye. Love you. Not everyone has someone in their life like Kate. I've just been so fortunate to have had her all these years as, a, as someone I've been able to, to help. Who has helped me? We grew up together. We went to school together. We went back to school together. When we were older, we were together as students and loved every minute of learning. It was something we shared very deeply. Our love of learning. And it created a, a special connection between us, but 
that was always secondary to the love we had for each other. We have always shared. And always loved. And she's probably the most special person in my, in my life. I love her so much. And Kate, Bella, Hey, um, you know what, Grandma? I just want, well, Grandma slash Mom. I just wanted to um, say happy birthday, and I feel honored to be here to celebrate your 80th. And I just also want to say that because we're celebrating your 80th, it's making me kind of look at my own life and what I want to accomplish by the time I'm 80 <laughs> and really living life to its fullest. So that's why I'm going to feed you. It's your fault. <laughs> I'm taking off. But um, anyway, thank you for having this party and the celebration of you. Hey, team mom. I'm sitting here doing this video and it feels so awkward. But um, I know that you'll probably be watching this and thinking about this lovely evening that Lorette and Colin put together for you. And um, I just want to say what an inspiration you have been for me and that you know um, that you really were a big, huge, instrumental part of me getting my act together at a very, very young age. And your strength has certainly filtered into my life. And um, I say all the time that you saved my life. And I am forever grateful for you. And I'm so glad you're my mom. I love you and happy birthday. Hi, Mom. Happy birthday. So glad to be celebrating your 80th birthday with you. And I think you should be so proud. So proud that you had seven children who had 20 children who will have many more children, maybe like another 40 and then that turns into like a lot. And you've really contributed to the world uh, in a meaningful way and each of them knows you and has learned a ton from you and uh, gotten a lot of strength from you. You are the most authentic, um, unconditional loving person and non-judgmental person I've ever met and it's really helped me to grow and I wish um, I hope to raise my children as you have raised us so love you anyway I just wanted to first start off by saying thank you um, I would have never ever met this wonderful human being that you brought into the world if it wasn't for you and um, I just look at, I, I watch over the years and I've learned so much over the years and um, you're her rock and she loves you so much and she's created a beautiful family off of your strength and I just want to wish you a happy 80th birthday and I love you too and I hope you have a good evening tonight. Bye. Happy birthday mom. It is an absolute privilege, honor, all of those things to be sitting here, your daughter, wishing you happy birthday and just want to reflect on how important your messages have been to me over the years as a kid when it seemed like it seemed like I had the mom that, you know, was a little off center. Ironically, I feel as though I've become that mom as well, um, but I hear your voice in so many decisions that I make and it's almost a, you know, what would, what would mom do? What would Kate do? Kind of a thing and it's almost always the right thing to do. Um, I would even say it's always the right thing to do but I leave a little margin of error there for the times, you know when they are. But you've been such a gift to me and your courage and your your choices and your unconventional, fierce way of living an authentic life have been such a model to me and I just love you so much and feel um, feel myself getting emotional even talking about it. But yeah, that's my, I'm gonna get a t-shirt. What would Kate do? What would mom do? Because uh, your voice is in me and I think you know that and we have some similar um, kinds of ways about us but uh, but there's things that you are way wiser than me about. So anyway, uh, this was an awesome party. Your swing, that was so fun. I'm so glad you went for it. And uh, I can't wait till the next party. I love you, Mom. <laughs>